What happened? It's oh, nothing. God. It's you? Are you okay? That's what I've been trying to tell Brock. Let me look at that. The bullet hey, grazed your shoulder. Needs attention. What? Barely broke the skin. Well, look, we got to get it clean and sterilized. Yeah, we might need an MRI, no, too. All right, I'll set it up, and you're supposed to be staying out of trouble. You need to listen to the doctor, okay? I'll start from the beginning. How did this happen? Yeah. Amanda, I know that this isn't ideal, but I, I am so sure that this is the only place you can be safe from the press. I'm, I'm quite sure that they already camped outside your building. I just wish we brought Trevor. I know. But believe me, he's in good hands with Opal. And the truth is, right now, you really need to focus on yourself, on, uh, on dealing with this situation. They are going to want some sort of a statement, though, you know. Well, they can come here. Look, I, I'm just so sorry. I mean, I feel responsible for this. I knew that there was a problem with, with Amanda Fan, and I just wish that I had done something more. Well, at least it just wasn't some kook, you know? It was just my crazy mom. I got here as soon as I could. Are you okay? Erica, fill me in. I've hired Jackson as your attorney. What the hell's with all the security? I practically got frisked just to get into my own company. It's Amanda. Turns out Amanda Fan was her mom. Janet Dillon? I guess things got pretty crazy. <laughs> crazy is what Janet does. Is, is Amanda okay? Janet's been arrested. Erica brought Amanda here to protect her from the press. Listen, we're going to be preemptive about this thing. We're going to hold a press conference. We're going to get the facts out there. And Amanda, you don't even have to be involved, OK? Do you guys care if I have a moment with Jake? Of course, of course. Excuse me. You don't want to do this, right? It's all right. You know what? I'll talk to him. I'll talk to him. I have a better idea. Why don't we just get a hotel room, OK? We'll ride it out this whole thing goes away. I can't do this, Jake. I want to quit. Janet Dillon has just been admitted upstairs until they reassess what meds she's on or off. <sighs> Thank God. Listen, I'm going to go look into security. Thank God. You're OK. Thank God Amanda's OK, too. You did good, kid. I let the perp get the drop on me and lock me in a closet. Oh. And Rob's the hero. I will tell him how grateful I am, okay? He deserves more. You want me to lift the suspension? Brock got in trouble because of me. Today, he probably saved my life. I'll do what I can. Thanks, Dad. That's the definition of hot. Babe, I don't think you mean it when you say you want to quit. I thought you'd love the idea. Well, I, I thought I'd love it, too. But now that I hear it, and I've seen you in action, I'd hate for you to wake up one morning and, and, you know, regret that you gave the whole thing up. I only need you and Trevor. Well, you have us. We're right here. We're not going anywhere. Forever. But this quitting thing, I mean, playing it safe, that's not you. Right? You put your ass off for this. Come on now. Look, Janet doesn't know what she's doing. It's not her fault. You're not going to let her stop you from going for the platinum, right? 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 <laughs> On your honor? Sealed with a kiss? Ball? Oh, I saw Janet in the flesh. You what? Erica will make sure her face is plastered everywhere. The brilliant, take-charge mogul who faced down death and emerged even more powerful. She isn't the one that's in a life-or-death situation. Yeah, wait till she spins it. All the publicity, it's gonna help her with the campaign. I'm already on it. Tell Amanda I'm glad she's all right. Where are you going? Well, sure as I'm not gonna beat Erica if I just stand around and watch. What are you looking at? What are you 
prefer. Close. Man, I've been looking all over for you. Why? Peanut, you're still warm. No, I'm good. Maybe he'd be a little more interested in this shiny thing right here. Take it. Get out of here. Can we wait for your shift? Erica, what if you had gotten there before the police? What if you had walked in on Janet and her with that gun? I hear. Babe, if we just wait for a little bit longer, the reporters, they'll wrap it up and they'll get out of here, okay? What was that? This morning I wouldn't kiss you because I was angry. Well, if I hadn't have left, you wouldn't have been attacked by Janet, you and Natalia. But you came home. And you kept a bad situation from getting worse. Jake, I needed you, and you were there. You always are. 